we know that m minus n equals 2. So we can solve for m and replace it in our two expressions and find out what those are just in terms of one variable. So this gives us m equals 2 plus n. So in column A, we have 4m minus 2n. And in column B, we have 4n minus 2m. So now we can plug in m for both of these and see which one is bigger. So we have 4, 2 plus n minus 2n. That gives us 8 plus 4n minus 2n. So this simplifies to 8 plus 2n. Now going back to column B, if we plug in m here, we have 4n minus 2, 2 plus n. When we expand this out, we get 4n minus 4 minus 2n. This simplifies to 2n minus 4. So now we have to compare these two. They're simplified. They're just written in terms of one variable. They both have a 2n, which is our unknown. But this one is 2n plus 8. This one is 2n minus 4. So this one must be bigger by a difference of uh, 12. So column A is always greater than column B.